Hey guys, what's up? It's Finch. Today I'm going to be laddering on a fresh alt with some mono dragons. So you guys saw me use three dragon dance users the other day, and a lot of people seem to like that. So today I've decided we're going to go ahead and ladder on a fresh alt and see how mono dragon can do against a lower ladder. I don't have high expectations, but I think it's going to be pretty fun. I'll probably get, you know, five, six games in and see what we do. So yeah, we're going to be leading with Elite Duraludon. Um, the idea is it gives us a quote-unquote very resist. Not really, though. It's got low special defense. It's just something neutral to fairy that also can kind of provide some resistance. So type things like flying. Um, neutrality to ice, so that could be cool. We're just gonna go for rocks. Turn one, he goes quiver dance. That's fine. I don't think he could really beat Dragonite. We're just gonna go hard Dragonite here. Preserve the sash here in case we need it for something later. So yeah, now we're just gonna go for the dual wing beat to take this out. Um, I see no reason to be scared unless he gets a flame body on the first dual wing beat hit. Then we probably lose. But that aside, we're fine. Um, anyway, so yeah, looking at the full team, we got a dual status hex U-turn Dragapult. We have a choice specs Zygarde. That's right. It's choice. See, I just told you exactly what was going to happen, and look, it happened. <laughs> so now if he's Psychic, he could actually kill us, which is a huge problem. If it's Psychic, Roost, Bug Buzz, then we actually can lose, which is kind of funny, because that's a bad set. Hopefully he doesn't have anything else to hit us, though. Giga Drain, yeah, it's not going to do tricks. We're fine. Um, we take him out anyway. It's just a shame that we're burnt, but no big deal, because we actually kind of swept him with the set if we actually... um, It's fine. I'm um, trying to think here. So yeah, we also have Spec Zygarde, which is kind of funny good here. Um... The idea is to lure things like Buzzwall in for Kieran Black, which is dragon sub dragon dance. So yeah, that'd be really cool. We also are scarf um we're scarf Latias here. We're gonna go scarf Latias here and we're just gonna go ahead and trick this scarf because it's pretty useless as it stands right now. And I'd love to use this dragon as fodder against something like the drill. So yeah, he goes rock to him. Okay, we're really in the low ladder here. This man's one thousand on the button. Oh you know. Um but yeah, no, so I figured why not use some moto dragon. It's been a pretty frustrating morning for me. Um unfortunately, we've um I've had to trash bin about five different recordings um, for a variety of different reasons. So first and foremost, I um, I had a recording that was doing really well on the NU ladder, but then it took so long to find a game. I had to pause, then I paused it, and then it got messed up, and it just wasn't good. So long story short, I got screwed over there. Um, from there, it was pretty hard because, um, whatchamacallit, because I... Um, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. For there, it was hard to record anything new because I was running a lot of time, but it worked out. I figured I'd get this one up, so yeah. Um, next up, we um, have this game, yeah. So this is, this is kind of where I'm at now, I guess. That makes sense. Um, sorry, that wasn't the most cohesive sentence at all. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like trying to remember like everything I did this morning. I'm like, nope, I'm like half asleep still. So yeah, it leaves you there, but he's just going to recover this off, I assume. Um, we're going to go Karen Black here. Yeah, now we can sub up on this. We can get some Dragon Dances up, and we'll be good to go. So yeah. Um, sub up here, he ice beams, now we can Dragon Dance, that's gonna just win the game, hopefully he just forfeits. I'm trying to get five games in basically, so. Um, if five games ends up being, you know, 10 minutes, great. If five games ends up being a half hour, sure. We just sub up here, and yeah, I don't see anything stopping us from just winning here now. Um, unless he's got like, you know, an Iron Defense Ferrothorn. That, that would do the trick. That'd actually be really annoying for my team. Don't be Iron Defense Ferrothorn. I need Spec Zygarde to break that. He goes, uh, yeah, I sub again. Ice Beam, um, we'll go one more. Yeah, we could just Dragon Dance all the way up, I guess. I see no reason not to. You know, we all, I think two should be enough. Um, I don't want to be too low in case um, for some reason we um, we need to encounter an Extreme Speed Dragonite. Yeah, no, because that could be annoying. Hopefully this kills here. Give me four hits, give me four hits. Okay, well, just kidding. We only get two hits. That's great. Um, we sub up one more time here. Kind of was wishing I was sub roost this game, but Mono Ice is dumb. He goes recovers. Yeah, um, hopefully we just get four hits here and then we're behind a sub. And or if he doesn't crit us, we're all still behind the subs, yeah. Nope, just get give me two hits here, or th three hits here, please. I'd love to get three hits here because then we can kill this and then we'll be done with this game. Oh my god, you're kidding me. I'm gonna get two hits every single time, aren't I? That's three in a row with two hits. Let's see if I go can can we go for four? Can we go for four? One, two, three, thank god. Okay, we got the third hit there. That's nice. For some reason, he recovered and just gave us another chance, so that's cool with me. Um, yeah. That's Ferrothorn here. We're just going to go for the Ice Spear again, because I think it kind of just wins from here. Um, I think it should be a 2 kill unless we get another 2-hitter. or Okay, get 3 hits. Dryball takes us out, obviously, but yeah, now he, he's going to die to the follow-up one again, assuming we get 3 hits. Um, because if we get only 2 hits, that's a problem. We all have to wait and see. We get 2 hits, of course, so yeah, that's just the story of this video already. <laughs> it's fine. No, we're going to go for the Zygarde. We're just going to lock into the Specs Core Enforcer. Um, and that's going to do a lot of damage to this, going to take us out. Okay, or not, if he's like max special defense, it might actually live now. Hopefully it doesn't. Spec Zygarde's pretty weak, but it's pretty fun. So, yeah. Um, waiting and seeing here. 
Let's keep going. We core Oh my god, look at that animation. That's such bad. Oh yeah, we get the first kill with Spec Zygarde. I hope he goes Dragonite or Dusclops. He's probably gonna go drill though. He goes drill, yeah. Because apparently everyone knows we're specs. So it's fine. We're gonna um we're gonna go Dragapult on the spin here. We also get um get a wisp buff on it. It'd be cool. That's not great. It's fine though. We can just go for the uh Earth Power here. It's actually a high roll on the Life Orb Earthquake too, because we got some bulk on that, I think. So yeah, that's unfortunate. Uh, he might be adamant, actually. If he's adamant, then we're quicker than it. So I guess we'll find out this turn if he stays in. Um, yeah, well, he's adamant, so that probably was a favorable roll for him then. That's fair. All right, so we get that kill there. Two kills for Spec Zygarde already. Hopefully we can just finish the game up. Yeah, no, that's basically four kills with Spec Zygarde. So we just switched out like the core and force. Yeah, let's get another game here with the Mono Dragon. I'm feeling it. Yeah, I'm feeling it. All right, nice. We're against the Hattori. Never mind. Less nice. We're actually against a DLC 1 team. It was a pretty solid team back then, too. Um, yeah, he's got Blissey, Hatterene, Crodon. Um, we're just going to lead with the Drowdon. We're just going to click Steel Beam turn 1, trying to catch the uh, Hatterene, I guess. Actually, we'll click Rocks turn 1. Now, nah, no one goes Hatterene on a damn Drowdon. Man, going Blissey for sure. We're well, just going to Earthquake. Yeah, he's going to Earthquake. Takes the Rock Wrecker. Okay, well. Um, we're just going to Draco, because he's got a turn of Recoil, I guess. Yeah, I'm thinking that's the play. We're going to just drop that Draco. And hopefully it's a 2 kill on him. It does 81. So yeah, there's a 2 kill on him that's still with me. Um, now I'm going to predict either a fairy type to come in, so we're just going to go for a steel beam and try and get like kind of a lot of damage on it on the way out. Hopefully preserve. Okay, well that's fine. That's fine. So we get rocks up and we trade the 1v1 here. Um, now we're going to go out here on black, and if he doesn't go Hatterene, we kind of win. Actually, you know what? Nah, I want to go um, I want to go Latias and trick something. Yeah, I want to go Latias and trick something. If I can trick the Hatterene into a non-fairy move, that'd be great. Or if I trick a Scarf fairy move, we can actually be fine with that. Uh, he goes this, that's fine. We can trick this into... Actually, I do not want to give this a Scarf. No, we're going to go Kieran Black here. Yeah, we're going to go Kieran Black here. Um, we should be fine. Hmm. Um. He goes try attack. Please don't get step. Okay. Well, let me get the one try. Well, let me get one ice spear off. And, okay, so that's fine. So now we can just healing rush back to this, and we're still in a good, good, good position long haul. So yeah, that's that's okay. It's not great. It's not great, but it's okay. So I'm hoping here he goes to like Blissey or Crawdon, um, because well, ideally Blissey because it's the most passive Pokemon. But he's probably gonna go Hatterene if I had to guess. If he goes Amoongus, we actually just outrun and just kind of kill it. So that'd be cool with me. But I don't think he's going Amoongus under any conditions. So we'll wait and see. Um, hmm. I'm just waiting on him to click here. But yeah, no. Um, I think Healing Wish and any Dragon kind of wins this. He goes Crawdon, that's fine. We're just gonna, um, Dragon Ball's the most expendable member at this point. If he some reason doesn't go for knockoff, then this is fine. Um, so yeah, we go Dragon Ball here. He goes Aqua Jet for some very unknown reason. We're just gonna go for that Wisp here and make things setting up easier. Um, yeah, no, that's fine. Because now we're just going to go Dragonite, and since he's burnt, we could just set up in his face. And um, I think a plus two dual wing beat might kill Hatterene, but also the thing is, Dranicus recovers so much, that's what I'm scared of. Hopefully he just stays in here. Okay, he stays in. Is he going to go for knock? He goes for Avalanche. That's 44 now, so I guess we just... Why is it Avalanche? I'm so confused as to why it's Avalanche. I don't understand anything anymore. Okay, it's, he knocks us off. That does basically the same as Avalanche because we didn't actually attack it. So now plus two, plus two. Hopefully this will do the trick. Um, oh, I wish I knew he was jetting. I could have done that. Okay, that's fine. We just do wing. Please hit. Please, if this dual wing beat misses, we actually lose the game. That would be really bad. That'd be like really, 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 really bad. Um, so please don't happen. That'd be sad. Um, I think he's probably more offensive. So looking at it, he's like running a bunch of random offensive sets. So yeah. Um, he took a, like a six that's been used before and just made it all these big berserk sets, which is kind of funny, um, I guess. But yeah, now we're against high boots. Um, he goes Blissey here, and it's not even... I don't know why he did that. Okay, we're just going to go Fire Punch so we don't miss. That's fine with me, though. Um, maybe you're scared of Iron Head, but like, if you're, you don't have a chance to scatter at this point. So, you're kind of out of luck. But he gives me another turn of Rocks in the Hat Arena, and now a Dual Wing Beat kills it. So, it looks like Dragonite's going to get the sweep that we've been long awaiting for. So, that's really cool. Um, so, yeah, no. Hopefully, we just hit here. We hit here, please. Can I hit here? I'd love to hit here. Thank you. 49. See, so it would have killed regardless. Earthquake might have even killed there. That's great. Okay, so we're going to win this game here. It's looking good. We're just going to go for the Fire Punch here. And even if he's max physical defense and lives and kills us, we can just win the game with Zygarde. So, yeah, no point risking. And it does kill, so it's good for me. He's Helmet, actually. But it's funny. A good game. All right, so up to 2 0. Let's keep it going. You know, two, three more games here. Why not? Um, yeah. 
So we're trying to find a game. We get uh, Eurus. He's got a drow. Oh my god, we got a drow on mirror match. You know what? We're leading it. We're gonna go for it. Oh, it's fine. We get thunder here. Hopefully he stays, and that'd be funny if our thunder. It mainly was there for Corviknight Skarmory, and so I'll steal it. But no, we'll take this. This was also there for Pex. He goes Scrappy. That's chill with me. We do thirty. We get the rocks up. We can just rocks, and we can just like Draco into Steel Beam or Steel Beam to spam. He goes for the Dragon Dance. Okay, that's actually kind of irrelevant. We're just gonna go Dragonite here. He's probably not Ice Beam. Ice Punch. Ice Beam Punch? Beam Punch? What the hell am I saying? But either way, um, yeah, we're just gonna go Dual Wing Beat. I'd imagine it kills. I also imagine at plus one we might be quicker than it, but I'm not gonna risk that because he might be just max speed. Yeah, Iron Head. Don't flinch. Okay, this is a problem now. This is a huge problem. We actually kind of lose now. This is so bad. Okay, so we get two hits there. Um, we should be fine then. I just can't have him. Um, he just can't dodge this Draco. Basically, if we do if he dodges this Draco, we might be fucked. We have to go to Draladon and break the sash, and we'll be down like three Pokemon. And here we hit that Draco. Okay, Scarf Lottie is quicker than plus two. Drafty, of course. Plus one Scrafty isn't even quicker than regular. So yeah, I mean, uh, but with that said, um, he goes Noivern and he's maybe he's Scarf Noivern, but otherwise we actually kind of yeah we just do that. That's fine with me. Um, but anyway, so yeah, he goes Draladon now. Um, we're just gonna keep Drake going for as long as we can. It's probably gonna be like forty, maybe thirty-five. But he's got solo special defense. I'm fine with this. Um, we do forty-two. So yeah, that means that it's time for us to go cure him and to click dragon dance and hopefully we just tank this easily um he's minus two something we do and then we should be good to go hmm yeah um okay he goes lantern he can't actually break our sub with lantern i'm assuming so we probably could just sub up on it and yeah i know we can't really hit it super hard actually we got terrible what am i saying yeah we can we go right through volt absorb this is perfect so yeah he goes volt switch doesn't break the sub and that's gonna be a good game oh uh, yeah good game I'm hopefully four for so I'm gonna get these five games done with. Nah, he goes guard. Okay, that's chill. We're just gonna go for the. Uh, why am I going ice? Actually, doesn't. I'm just gonna go with fusion bolt. Yeah, fusion bolt surely kills. Um, but yeah, no. So this looks really good. Mono dragon might end up pulling the five zero. I'm thinking this game three. So let's get going. Let's get going for sure. I'll be sure to leave this team link in the description below. By the way, guys. Um, I know you guys want to try this out. We got some heat here. Uh, it's kind of fun. I kind of want to like do these like meme videos like once or twice a week, just because why not. He's Boots Pelipper, which I find to be kind of bizarre, but sure. Um, whatever floats your boat, I guess. Um, Fusion Bolt there, takes that out. See, yep, that's going to make it. Um, it's going to put us in a, um, a fourth two position. He's going to go Lantern. He's going to be like, wait, I don't take Fusion Bolts because he's got Terra Volts. And yeah, I'm going to be like, yup, goodbye. Good riddance. Farewell. Ban Kieran Black. And that's going to be that for the game. He's going to draw it on. We're just going to go Ice Spear. And I'm assuming three hits will take him out. Maybe two. This thing has nice physical bulk, I got to say. And keep in mind, steel typing does negate the super effective damage that. Yeah, so it's actually only going to be two hits. Okay, that's cool. So yeah, it's another win there. And let's keep the ball rolling. Let's keep the ball rolling for sure. Um, hmm. Okay, this time we're against a, like, a legit team. He's got Blaziken and Spectre and all you Pokemon. That's cool. Um... I like lead Duraldon though, it kind of fix. It's gonna get a kill, hopefully. Huh. So we're against Jason, 5823. He's got 1125, this is probably our best opponent. Yeah, not that 1125 is really impressive or anything. Let's see what his JC is. That, that'll be tall. Could be like a decent player, like a fresher. No, it's not. Okay, bring it on. He goes Landorus. We're just gonna go for the Draco here. Because it's something I'm feeling like. Hopefully, he doesn't go for like a Scarf U turn. Hopefully, he just goes for like an Earthquake, locks in the Earthquake. That'd be great. Or maybe he's like, okay, he's, well, that's not okay. Um, let's go for the Quake here. We'll Quake in the Steel Beam. Yeah, that's fine. He goes Finny. Oh, that works perfect. So now we get Rocks up. So it's basically just, we both traded Rocks and he got his Finny in. So it's fine. Thunder would be great to hit here. I'd love hitting Thunder here. Please hit Thunder. Good. You win your Thunder. It's just 45. Okay. You calm minded. Um, I'd like to hit another. Don't be Dranicus. That'd be really bad. Um, yeah, we're going to just Thunder again here. Um, does nice to 27. He's Moonblast. That's perfect. So now we're just going to Steel Beam. Take this out. And we should be good to go. Yeah, Draining his, draining his Pokemon are basically the weakness of this team. So when we beat that Hatterene, I was so happy. Um, but yeah, no, we'll take that for sure. Um, okay. So yeah, we'll Steel Beam here. That'll leave him at like 20, 25%. And then we should be able to take him out with the Cure on Black Fusion Bolt. Yeah, it takes at least him even lower. Okay, this is perfect. So now, yeah. We just fusion bolt here. We take this. We honestly could just get a dragon dance up here and win the game. We probably live a moonblast, but I don't think it's worth risking. Um, 
Yeah, no, Kieran Black looks amazing here, though, as always. Kieran Black, bullpen coverage is just so fucking busted on this thing. Protect ain't saving you from crap, although I wish I dragon dance now, especially. Um, protect lefties on Vinny's kind of weird. I feel like Drenicus would have been better. Um, although, I think Moonblast was like just taunt or sub would be even better. Like the best of the best. Does that make the Eagles Landers? Okay, that's fine with me. We know he's slower, so we're just going to go for the Ice Spear now. And after Rocks, he's probably. Um, He's probably going to be in range, even if we're minus one. So, yeah, we're fine. Uh, hopefully, I, I think it might take three hits here. But, yeah, we should be good to go. Yeah, just 29. So, we're going to need three hits. We're going to need four hits, maybe. We get the... Okay, three hits. Perfect. Yeah, we get that. We get the go. Get that hell out of there. Not like it should have been in range, regardless. Um, because we would have hit the Draco turn one. So, yeah, we'll take that. It's good for us. He's probably going to go to the Blaziken. Now, he goes to the Tornadus, which is silly. Because we can now Dragon Dance in its face. Probably multiple times, but at least once. Um, he's focused last. We can not live multiple hits. So, we'll wait and see. He goes Fog, which is really silly. We're going to go for another Dragon Dance here. Um, and then we should win the game. Um, unless he confuses us. No confusion. Perfect. So now we're going to go for that Icicle Spear here, and that'll be that. Okay, Kieran Black is just winning every game. Dragon Knight won the first game, but now Kieran Black's just on a tear. Um, I guess Zygarde kind of had an assist in that first game as well. But yeah, no. Um, this has been good. This has been good for sure. All right, so we get the Rillaboom in here. Rillaboom's going to die to Ice Sphere, of course. And we are looking great, guys. This has been so funny. Fake out. Fake out. Fake out. Um, that's crazy. All righty. Well, that's fine with me. Um, we'll get this Ice Sphere off here. Grassy Glide wouldn't have break the subs. We should, probably could have subbed there, but it's fine regardless. Um, I don't know. No point getting greedy. If he went for like a Drain Punch or some crap, or Superpower or some crap, broke the sub, and he went for Grassy Glide and got a crit, that would have been really annoying. So, yeah. And Blaziken, what we're going to do is we're going to sub the first turn. We're plus two speed, so we know we're quicker than it, even if it's plus one. So if he protects for some reason, like tries to get like stacking protects, he'll be fine. I don't think that's going to be the play stuff. He's just forfeits. All right, that's perfect. So we're up to 4 0. Let's go for one more here. Maybe if it's an underwhelming game, we'll go for two more. We'll have to wait and see. But yeah, no, I'm digging this, guys. I'm digging this for sure. Um, all right, Gangster Ethan. Um, he's got. Three dragons of the zone here. So this is going to be a fast-paced game. We're just going to leave with our Duraludon because you already know it's been putting in the work. Lead Duraludon has been covering and carrying rather its weight every single game. So it's dope. Um, yeah. Ooh. He leaves with Mosa. We're just going to click Draco right here. Draco picks. Draco picks all day and tomorrow. So yeah. I have to say he's going to get rocks if he jump kicks, which is stupid because it's not close combat. And thankfully for him, he hits, but. Unfortunate for him, we are Sash and we take him out, so it's a good trade for us. He's probably gonna go ahead and have to go to. Bleh, that was not English. He's probably going to have to go to one of his priority Pokemon or fast Pokemon. That that's basically means that Dragonite has priority. Okay, well he's Dragon Dance in our face. That's fine with me. Um, because we've got uh things to deal with it. I guess you could say in the back. Yeah, no. Maybe that was a little greedy. I think we're fine. Though. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, plus two. Um, I think we're fine, because Ladia should be quicker. Unless he's plus speed, then that's a problem. You don't. Oh my God! He killed. Crap. We might be. In, we might be screwed. We might have fucked that up. All right. I might have messed that up. Hopefully, he's scared of extreme speed here, and goes for his own extreme speed. Hey, Iron. Don't flinch. Thank God. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. He, yeah. He can use dual wing beat. So dual wing beat wouldn't have um, killed. I guess. Actually, might have because that Iron hit did fifty. Yeah. No, he should have dual wing beat. All right. We're fine anyway. Um. Just kidding. We might just lose to this. Um. Zygarde is the least useful Pokemon. Um, we'll just go for the Core Enforcer. We should be able to tank and hit if he's Dragon Darts that Draco, so yeah. Um, let's enforce the core of this Dragapult. Why not? Um, hopefully, we get a setup turn with Kiram at some point. Um, I think we're kind of scared, though. That Exor is being quicker than the Kiram. We, we're going to have to carry with a Dragapult, basically. Yeah. Um, custom. Anyway, just waiting here. Um, yep, yeah, we live that. And then we get the Core Enforcer off. That's cool. Um, he goes near Lego. That's fine with me. We're just going to go ahead and get the Core Enforcer off. He goes Power Gem. Okay. So now what we're going to do here is we're going to get a Thunder Wave off here. Hopefully we stomach this. Um, and then maybe we just got to kind of play. Um, Oh, oh, come on, he gets a crit. Are you kidding? Dude, are you serious? Man, that's lame. So we don't get the 5-0. Oh, well, that's fine. Um, yeah, now we just lose. 
Um, that's a really unfortunate way to end it because we had it. Um, we really just needed to deal with there and Hex put him in range. Um, actually, okay, so here's what would have happened. We would click click T-Wave and then um, on the first turn we get Paralysis, um, we just win because either we get Hex and it's two kills or we just spam Substitute with Curem because we're quicker. And then the first turn we get a Dragon Dance, then once we get a Dragon Dance, we're quicker than Exorus and we just win. So yeah, we had five turns to get one Paralysis, which is really favorable for us, so... It happens that way. If he was adamant on Hexorus, we won too. So, yeah, I mean, I figured that we probably had a good job there, but that's fine. I mean, it's cool playing with Mono Dragon regardless. Um, but yeah, no. All right, peace out, guys. Have a great day. Bye.